Uh, all right. I knew this would happen. I knew this would happen. <laughs> they wouldn't let us beat the game. They just wouldn't let us beat the game. We got close. We got close. We got all the way to, you know, 62, 63% mastery. I was recording updates. Um, at the time, I had finished cooking. Not anymore. I finished mining, though. That, that one stayed. And fishing stayed finished. Uh, thieving. <sighs> I thought I was done thieving, but no. <laughs> uh, a lot has happened, apparently. A lot, a lot, a lot. Okay, uh, let, let's explore a bit, try to figure it out on our own, and then we'll look at the change log and see what's really going on. So, two skills that I thought I had finished are now back on the table, and even more distressingly, and now top prioritizingly, there's a whole lot of question marks suddenly up in here. So what does this mean? What does this mean? Um, let's first look at cooking. Enable perfect cooks. This is the same. Select recipe to cook. Whoa! Okay, this is hype. This is actually super hype. I am actually, like, really, really excited about this rework. Am I a little cheese? That I got pushed back so far on, like, the very things that I thought I had finished. A little, a little, but just a little. Um, so I don't know, do we need to unlock more recipes? Because this does not account for, um, a lot. So, I mean, furnace required, pot required. Beef required, we don't have beef. Everything else we've already done. So these, I guess, are the more advanced reference, uh, the advanced recipes. So let's look in the shop. There we go. Furnace. Yes. Strong furnace. Yes. Magic furnace. Yes. Pot. Yes. Strong pot. Yes. Magic pot. Yes. All right. Good. <laughs> Cooking upgrade one. Automatically equip food that is actively cooked. If that food is already equipped or an empty food slot is available, this can be toggled on or off. Okay, uh, yeah, we'll buy it. When running out of food in combat, automatically swap to a different food slot that contains food. Ooh, yeah, we'll buy that. So it looks like we're gonna get food that's even better than whales, perhaps. Which is exciting. See if there's anything else for sale. Doesn't look like it. Just this guy. Ooh, flour, cheese, and cream. Well, we'll buy some of those. Let's, uh, let's clear up a few things in the inventory. We don't need all of this dragon equipment. So yeah, this is what I've been working on. Um, I think maybe I'll just release the up the video so far. Because clearly we have bigger priorities. We have bigger fish to fry. <laughs> uh, so that video might come out, like, tomorrow. Oops, that's not the one I meant to upgrade. La la la. Um... And then, you know, for today, okay, let's stop creating these. Let's sell you, 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 you. Get a few more inventory slots. Let's uh, upgrade these to get another inventory slot. Mm, this will actually want again. That's kind of cool. Uh, all right, all right. So let's let's look. So now we have these other recipes. <laughs> oh, this is awesome! Y'all, look at all this stuff we can make. Oh, this is so exciting! I love it. I love it. I love it. Um, and in here, ooh, shoopsh. Okay. So uh, first, let's try to figure out where we can get these new ingredients. Three of them are here. Get some. Get some flour. Get some cheese. Get some cream. Uh, I assume some of them, like, maybe now you drop chicken? Yeah, now you drop beef? Yeah. This is so great. This is one of the things that, in RuneScape, um, I felt like... What? Why am I not just insta-killing it? What the heck? What? Max hit... What? Max hit, min hit. I like that that's, that's, that's a nice quality of life thing that just got added too. But why is my max hit so low? What am I attacking with? Aren't I casting... Well, I'm taking, I'm casting wind strike, I guess. I guess it... 
Uh, okay, it doesn't matter. Are we getting chicken? Yes. We got some chicken. Okay, that's all I wanted. Um, of course, we're going to have to get way more chicken and way more beef. Um, but we'll cover that when we cover that. The, the little pop-ups for damage changed, too. They're more sophisticated looking. Get some beef from you. I don't know why. Let's do this. There we go. Now we'll just insta-gib them. There we go, we got some beef. Uh, well, let's do a little scan and see if anybody else is dropping anything new. Plant. Potatoes. Yeah, potatoes are old. This, These guys just drop, drop seeds. Right. Uh, you know what, this is pretty tedious. Uh, I think maybe we'll go back and explore if it looks like we're missing things. Okay, so what kind of stuff can we cook that we couldn't cook before? Beef. Active cook, passive cook. Passive cook? I don't quite understand that. Automatically equip food when it's made. Enable perfect cooks. Beef perfect. Beef normal. This one heals for five more experience. Oh, so I gotta go back and cook everything until I proc the perfect cook too. I see. Okay, that's fine. Um, I think we can just sell these for now to get inventory space. Maybe there's a recipe that requires cooked beef. That'd be kind of interesting. Um, so yeah, let's let's see. Can we proc like a perfect whale? I kind of I'm just curious. Active cook, perf passive cook. Oh, so we have a hundred percent chance for a perfect cook. Nice. How much does this heal you for now? Nice. Okay, awesome. Uh, so this is starting to account for a lot of these item slots. Perfect whale, beef perfect. Nice. Okay, let's let's go on a little item collection frenzy. Okay, what else? What else do we have in the inventory? We have herring. Let's get a perfect herring. Um, we have perfect seahorse got a perfect seahorse there are some that we're missing um and also we're gonna run out of inventory space is there other stuff i can clear out man inventory space is getting so micromanagey uh let's sell you you and you and sell these bones for now uh Anything else? Not really worth hanging on to for now. Jeez. Oh, we can sell these treasure chests. Actually, maybe we want to open them now. Maybe they have things that are interesting to us now. Uh, we can sell... Mm, I think we can sell these necklaces. We don't really need those. All of these rings are... There's some circumstances in which they're useful, I would imagine. So leather cowls we don't need. So they're just other random crap we've made that we don't need. These dragon javelin heads, I kind of doubt we're ever going to make dragon javelins, given that we have infinity ancient javelins. Short bows. Bowstrings, I'll just buy them again. Uh, same with... Oh, I don't know, maybe we should hold on to the, the feathers. So we'll just end up buying them again. Uh... We can sell a bunch of our cooked food. Uh, unless they need them for recipes. And I think something in Herblord needs... Okay, so we'll do those a bit later. We have some slots to work with for now, at least. Okay, enough to finish the fish, I think. So we did that. We gotta do trout. Get a perfect trout. Nice. Mm, perfect salmon. Nice. Lobster. Perfecto. Swordfish. Looking good. Slice it up with the swordfish. The fish that fishes too. The angler fish. Going down deep for that one. Oh, we got... 
the fan fish. I don't think you're actually supposed to eat these. I'm pretty sure they're full of neurotoxin. They're pretty dangerous. But what do I know? Let's make a perfect crab. But really, every crab is perfect. The crab being the ideal form in which all crustaceans eventually converge onto. Uh, we can make a perfect crab. Excuse me. Yeah, that's looking good. We can make a perfect shark. Perfect dark? Nah, perfect shark. <laughs> Alright, see? Oh, uh, we can make a perfect cave fish. That is my only wish for this dish, is a perfect cave fish. And then we can make a perfect manta ray. What a beautiful day for a perfect manta ray. And uh, that takes care of the boring recipes. Excellent. Oh, wait, we gotta catch ourselves a shrimp and a sardine and then cook those. Hold on. First, we can sell. You, 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 you. For a nice 7,000. 7, uh, then we're gonna catch a shrimp. Give me the shrimp. Yeah. Now we're gonna catch a sardine. Give me the sardine. Yeah. And then we're gonna cook a perfect shrimp. Boom, easy. And then we're gonna cook a perfect sardine. All right, now let's look at where we're at. Make sure we didn't miss one. So here is all of the perfect fish. We did it. These I'm guessing are more ingredients. And these are the perfect forms, or maybe these are the base forms of the new recipes. These are ingredients. Actually, I don't know. It's very inconsistent because it goes raw beef, beef, and then raw chicken. So I don't think we can deduce very much. Okay. Next, are there other recipes we can cook right now? Bread. Will we proc the perfect? I kind of doubt it, but we'll find out. Um, we could like level it up a bunch and try to increase our chances of hitting perfect, but that seems unnecessary right now. We'll, we'll go back for these perfects later, maybe. We can make some chicken. All right, we can make, oh, we need more beef. We can make a pizza with our tomatoes from our vegetable garden. I love this, I love this. I already talked about how much I love skills that take things here and there from throughout the game. Um, uh, and combine them in novel ways. And this is just my most favorite subject, food, because I love food. Um, what else we got? Cherries and apples are new things. Um, strawberry cake we can make. Cherries and apples. Are there new seeds? No way, right? We're still at max. Wait a minute. <gasps> Whoa, no way, no way, no way. No way. We're, we even, whoa, whoa, whoa. We have to farm cherries and apples now? Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. We got, we got a lot going on. Okay, carrot cake, we can make. How's our inventory looking? Okay, so we gotta get some of these new seeds. And I don't know the best way to do it. Okay, what can we make in the pot? Soup, we can make. John and we can make a hearty soup. Oh man, this is actually making me hungry. <laughs> I haven't eaten today yet. So I'm looking at all these tasty Melvoir recipes and I'm like, yeah, cream corn soup. Yeah, that sounds good. All right, so we're in a pretty good position to tackle this new content in that I've been hoarding stuff like crazy. We already have every other skill maxed out so we can get at all of the stuff we need pretty trivially. My bank is full. That's no good. 
Let's sell a bunch of food. Make a nice little profit. Uh, so we gotta cook a chicken soup again for the soul and for the item log. All right, let's see how we're looking now. Okay, so we're spottily filling in this section. We need to get the new veggies. These guys are down here for some reason. Okay, so let's now look at thieving. Okay. Uh, continue thieving while stunned. Okay. Yeah, I'm fine with getting fun stunned, because we'll auto eat. Max hit is max. Okay, there's a lot here. What's the max max hit? Two sixty nine. Uh, yeah, we're totally fine. Okay. Uh, let's start thieving some people. Um, is there anything we can do to make this better? Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. Uh, wild. Um. Let's put on our hat, because the resource preservation clown, cr cr crown makes me look like a clown, because it doesn't do anything for thieving. There's no resource to preserve. Where is that? Oh, noir. Okay. Uh, so, yeah, let's rob a woman. Undiscovered, I undiscovered item. Undiscovered item. All right. Let's see if we get an undiscovered item. No. 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 <laughs> we ranked up. No. Undiscovered item. Possible rare drops. Possible area unique drops. Possible NPC unique drops. Okay. Let's let's move on maybe. Pickpocket this guy for a little bit. Let's see if so we can get any of this stuff and fill up our inventory with junk. <laughs> and then there's three undiscovered items here. This is pretty exciting. This is pretty exciting, I gotta say. I don't really know how best to present this new content because I don't know how rare these rare drops. Oh, there's one! What is that? Crate of basic supplies. And what's in there? Bunch of junk. All right then. And we got, actually that's kind of useful for the, when we finally return to mastery. Okay, uh, let's, let's move on from you to, we'll just kind of stealth our way around these low-lying areas. Th three more undiscovered items across these two people. We've gotten a bunch of garbage, of course. How about you? Four. All right, sweet, okay. This is crazy, so much new content, so much new content. Um, but yeah, I don't really know how to present it because, you know, conceivably we're just sitting here indefinitely until we get these rare drops. Um, but that's okay because we need to build up mastery for these people too, these new victims. Um, so it is probably just gonna be something that happens mostly off camera, unfortunately. Uh, but I could make a compilation video checking back in when I get uh, these rare drops and, and checking out what they are. Especially if they're new crates and chests and stuff. It's kind of exciting. Alright, let's, uh, let's try this merchant here. Drops a bunch of herbs. These could be the new seeds because they're in multiple quantities. So that's interesting. And then farmerman. You get the cherry seeds now, and these must be where the apple seeds are. It's interesting that the cherry seeds, I guess because it's a common drop, shows up in the common drop table. Um, to be honest, I really just want to rob Bob the farmer for quite a while, so we can get a lot of apple seeds and cherry seeds, and getting more magic tree seeds would be nice too. But it's unfortunate because we've already maxed mastery for Bob the farmer, um, but he does give us a decent amount of mastery pool experience, so we can start spending that on other people. What, what checkpoints do we want here? 
Oh, yeah, we need this. We need to get to this for sure. For sure, for sure. Okay, uh, there's also like a stealth rating. Yeah, this, this is what, this is what we're dealing with here. We've got a success rate of 100% for everybody so far, so we're never getting stunned. Okay, what does the assistant cook have? Undiscovered item. Hype. You can just get straight up pizza from him. Oh, I have pizza in the fridge. No, I already ate it. <laughs> what a roller coaster. Uh, all right, let's rob the assistant cook for a little bit. See what's going on. Get some bread and get some chicken. Our inventory filling up with crap yet again. Let's open these. Apple tree seeds. Oh, we got some. We got some. Okay, that's hype. Um, don't want to sell those. But we can sell, like, our chicken soup. These arrows. Do I honest... I don't have any... Really? I don't have any lemon tile herb? Okay, well, that's a problem. Because I'll definitely need those eventually. Okay, beef pie we forgot to make. Because <laughs> I forgot to go back and get more beef. Uh, but we just stole it, so that's all good, too. Alright. Uh, oh, this is so exciting. Okay, okay. Um... What's the chef got? More undiscovered items. We can skip our way into some of the recipes with the chef, too. So that's nice. Okay, that's fine. Uh, good. The dock hand has a bunch of fish and some undiscovereds. Makes sense. I've been stunned. Oh, our success rate is down to 80. All right, well, that's fair. And then you've got a lot of stuff, a bunch of undiscovered items. Snack. Um, okay, let's hype. How about the troll? Just a bunch of junk. Getting the eyeballs is kind of cool, though. It feels like no combat accounts have gotten a huge upgrade from this update because the amount of stuff you can get from stealing is way, way higher than before. Like, the eyeballs, I think, used to be a big limiter, probably, because you can only get them from combat. Actually, though, the only things they're useful for are potions that are only good for combat. <laughs> I guess nobody really plays no combat accounts. I just did for a while. I guess most people... Um, play combat only accounts if they want to do something like that. Okay, how about the Cyclops? Okay, how about the Cyclops now? Bunch of undiscovered stuff. Okay, magic logs, that's cool. And we're down to a 61% chance. Wow, wow. So it is actually pretty helpful to get up to uh, this plus 100 thieving stealth, I think. Wow, okay. Okay, uh, nothing too interesting from these guys. How about you? Bunch of undiscovereds, bunch of logs. I don't know why, just on the offhand chance that we roll one of the undiscovered items, I guess. But I think the odds are pretty low. And you, pretty similar, sure, sure. We'll, we'll pickpocket you a couple times just for good measure. Don't expect to get anything. You have a bunch of equipment. It's all going to be so annoying in terms of inventory space. Maybe it is time to invest in more bank slots. Because it's getting more and more annoying trying to find uh, things that I can get rid of. These are easy things to get rid of right now. Oh, we're actually okay for a little bit. Uh, the night. Up to 1,000 of something. What could that be? Feathers? Battle axe, been stunned. So the sixty percent. It was the 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 squire had a lower sixty percent rate or success rate. That's kind of funny. All right, uh, these guys I assume drop runes. They drop all sorts of stuff. Sure, for good measure, we'll try to see if we can grab a unique of some sort. No, but this may be a good way to get runes, anyways. And you, again, I'm starting to think maybe this one undiscovered rare drop is uh, 
consistent. Like, it's actually just the same for all of them. Also, I really like the undiscovered item, by the way. That's so exciting. That's so much more exciting than showing you what you don't have, you know? Uh, all right. Uh, let's head to the castle. Don't know what's going on here. Ooh, that's exciting. Um, I really like how this is set up. It feels so much more real and in-universe that you're heading in from towns out into the wilderness, into these various uh, professional settings, just thieving everywhere, and then in the end you make it into the castle itself, where presumably there's lots of really valuable stuff. But presumably we will not hit it anytime soon. You've got a bunch of jewelry, makes sense. Princess. I'm trying to think of that Zelda CGI line. Well, excuse me, princess. <laughs> and the king. More jewelry. You just get some diamonds. That's pretty sweet. And so much undiscovered stuff. So much undiscovered stuff. Okay, so this is another big chunk of items. We're up to 94% again. Uh, so, uh, in terms of cooking, what's left? These we've all taken care of. We even got the perfect beef. All right, we got to make another. I haven't done this in a while. Okay, so cooking, new items, perfect recipes. These are going to be kind of tedious. Um, so before, whoa, whoa, where did it go? Before, oh, two seconds, no way. <laughs> um, oh yeah, shout outs to the person that told me about that, that you can have it go into offline mode if it loses focus. So it, it just goes into offline mode instead of, um, just losing progress entirely. Can I just buy, oh, that's so awesome. Okay, uh, I wonder if they did that for like summoning too. Actually, I think they did already, like a while ago. Yeah, yeah, they did. Okay. Uh, so what recipes have we not made? So first, cherry, apple, recipes, plant, cherry, apple, seeds, which means I think the first thing we really have to do, can we just kill Mr. Man? Anybody here have cherry seeds? No, we gotta steal cherry seeds. Okay, so you do not have cherry seeds. You only have herbs. You, on the other hand, do have cherry seeds. So this is unfortunate because we've already maxed out this dude, but we're gonna start by robbing the farmer for a while. I'm trying to get some cherry seeds. Our bank is full. That's unfortunate. That could have been a cherry seed drop because we have seeds. We have slots already for the other seeds. Fine. Okay, so get cherry seeds. Plant cherry apple seeds. The hardest part, the hardest thing, will not to just muscle memory replant all of the really high experience plants. Uh, and actually remember to plant cherries and apples. Okay. Uh, cherry apple recipes. Perfect recipes. I think that's lower tier. And then thieving new items. Let's just get them. And then the perfect recipes is after that. And then. And then. Back to mastery grind. Okay. Uh, we're gonna wait to see if we get cherry seeds here. I don't think we'll need many. Not until we go for the perfect recipes. Um. Let's look at, hmm. so I don't know, I don't think we're going to be able to increase this very much, so it's going to be pretty low odds, but that's okay. Okay, uh, the next thing I want to do while we're waiting to try to roll cherry seeds, which we do not have yet, just to confirm, we have, where are the apple seeds? There's the apple seeds, cherry seeds probably go here. Um... Let's look at the change log and see if uh, there's anything 
exciting. Oh, 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 oh. Actually, do I even want to look at this? The only thing I wanted to understand was like active cook, passive cook. What does that mean? Active cook, passive cook. Active cook. So this just does one and then it stops, maybe? No. Hey, we got the perfect. That's awesome. Passive cook. Uh, okay. We'll go back to robbing Mr. Man for a bit. I'm going to scroll fast Okay, to the bottom. Try not to look. Ancient sword rework. Hmm. Neat. New potion UI, I saw that. New agility obstacles. Huh. Okay, cool. Um... Active cooking, passive cooking. Oh, oh. Mmm, okay, I see, I see. Okay, well, that's good to know. No skill XP, master XP. Oh, mmm, ah, ooh, ah, ooh. Okay. That's all right, though. We can still just cook whales this way or something. All right, sure. All right, that makes sense. Okay, I get it. Uh, perfect cook. That makes sense. Yeah, I was about to say it could be annoying if you didn't if you somehow got to max mastery without getting the imperfect one. It's the same problem with like it's hard to get burnt food after a while. The removal of burnt items. Huh. Ah. I see, I see, okay. So I've got some more now impossible to get legacy items. He 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 he. He 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 he. Okay, cool. So that, that actually dropped my item completion percentage even more, kind of like artificially. All right, uh, I think I think we can stop recording here. Um, I'm just going to get at it with this plan. And maybe when we're hitting milestones along these, we will record little updates and make a compilation video as we have for the mastery grind. Something like that, sounds good. Oh, I'm so excited. So many more items to get. All right, that's all for now. Bye-bye.